Welcome to our J Crazy News headlines and a special Sunday evening for those who are watching this news broadcast. Now to my viewers and my subscribers, we head towards the parish of St. James, where last night it was chaos and also shooting at the Freeport Police Lockup in Montego Bay, St. James. Now in that shooting, two prisoners got shot as well as a police officer while the prisoner got shot in his neck now they said that two prisoners got into an altercation where one of the prisoner alleged to be inflicted with stab wounds they said that while going for treatment he disarmed the, a police officer and head back to the jail cell where he fired around seven shots hitting two inmates and also a police officer during that chaos and other prisoners behaving boisterous you name it now to say that one of the alleged criminal elements who was involved in the altercation at first and disarmed the police officer and shot two inmates including a police officer as well is the alleged top knockies from Norwood St. James Paradise Crescent wanted man in 2022 Christopher Campbell aka Bigfoot now it is said that Bigfoot had an altercation with a youth from Gully where Bigfoot was alleged to be stabbed during the process. As went to treatment, the Sarah police officer went back and fired around seven shots where two inmates were hit, including a police officer. Now it is also said that the police officer gave him that gun. Now this is coming from a video which was circulated all over social media last night between today and that video had prisoners in the Freeport lockup explaining what actually took place last night and how many shots were fired. However, Indicom is investigating. Now I said before in our video with all over social media, prisoners in the Freeport police lockup are saying that not no go so but disarm that police officer gave Bigfoot the gun to go back into jail cell to shoot that man and also an inmate unfortunately the police officer was shot as well in the process now if these allegations are true do you know we are seeing evidence of corruption in our jail cells, police stations, as well as police lockup, as well as big prisons. Because there is no in hell a police officer could be so stupid to jeopardize his life, his career, his job, in bread, in duo, you name it. To give a criminal a gun to go back into a jail cell and attempt to kill a next inmate who he had a dispute with earlier. There's no way in hell he could do that. The officer would be very stupid and careless and should be removed from the force. However, it shows how irresponsible police officers are in the prison cells, the jail cells, and the police lockup. There's no in hell a prisoner could disarm if he did disarm the police officer. Disarm him so easy to run back into that prison cell and fire seven shots. Nobody's asking the same question like I do. Was Bigfoot in any handcuffs? Because it seems as if 
he wasn't in any handcuffs. Even though he was alleged to be injured during a stabbing, he still would have to be in handcuffs and taken to a medical facility for treatment. Now, as police officers working in prison cells, police station, police lockup, jail cells, you name it, you are employed to do your job effectively. Not there to do favors that are unscrupulous for criminals. You are there to do your job effectively and carefully. Last night's event at the Freeport Police Lockup should not repeat itself. It should not happen again. Matters could have been worse. A policeman or ex inmate could have been killed. This is a sloppy job. A sloppy work by police officers. You have to be alert and also careful what you're doing at these prison lockups. Remember, you are dealing with hardcore hardened criminals who have crimes very from murders, attempted shooting. You have to be alert as police officers and stop being so careless and carefree. This should not repeat itself again. Now we head back towards Davidton in Manchester. Yesterday video I made mention of a man who was shot and killed by the police during a confrontation in Davidton, Manchester on Saturday morning around 4.30 a.m. Now, his name is Andre Knight, a.k.a. Boxer, 41 years of age, a construction worker of Davidton in the parish of Manchester. Now, this is his picture that you see on your screen currently. Now the police went to his premises 4.30 Saturday morning to issue a search warrant where the police team got into a confrontation with Boxer. Now Boxer pointed a gun towards the police team. The police had no choice but to defend themselves where night was shot and killed in the due process. They said that Andre Knight, aka Boxer, was one of the alleged criminal elements behind the murder of CJ Cunningham, who is also from Davidton in Manchester. Now you know CJ Cunningham got a Prime Minister's award when it comes down to agriculture and he was a beacon of hope for the youths in Davidton, Manchester. However, he was murdered on a construction site. Now it was the parish of St. Elizabeth where a farmer was found in the Magati area with chop wounds to his head. Deceased has been ID as 46 year old Mark Robinson of Vauxhall District in Magati, St. Elizabeth. Now, based on information, around 7 pm last night, the body of Mark Robinson was found along the roadway in Magati by residents. The police was summoned to the scene and arrived. Several chap wounds were observed or seen to the head of. Mark Robinson. So far, there is no motive as yet as to why he was murdered. The police are investigating. This is Jay Crazy again until then. President Safe Sunday evening. Yeah man, I'm here see a black legend. I'm here represent for Jay Crazy YouTube reviewing channel. So watch, like,
comment, subscribe, and share out the thing. JK is a YouTube review channel. We review news and entertainment. Celebrity monster movements as well. JK is in a play when him a review the thing. Then JK is a YouTube review channel. We review news and entertainment. Celebrity lifestyle movements as well. JK is in a play when him a review the thing. Then review the thing. Then review the thing. Then JK is reviewing news, entertainment, and celebrity lifestyle. Review the thing. Then review the thing. Then JK.